Hey friends and welcome to today's video. Today I'm showing you stuff that I got from Primark. Hey Main Street friends, welcome, welcome. So I recently went to a Primark for the first time ever and let me tell you that store is bomb.com. I already want to go back. So I went to the one that is located in King of Prussia. Primark is generally a UK only store. I think we have like two in the US now. So we were in Pennsylvania and I went to the King of Prussia mall and went to the Primark and I had a blast. I basically went looking for uh, the Disney pajama sets and I also really wanted the Mickey shoes that I keep seeing all over Instagram that have the cute little bows on them. Unfortunately, I did not find those. So I am going to probably look online, maybe eBay, and try to order those. Or if any of you know where I can get Primark stuff other than eBay, let me know down below in the comments. But yeah, I did manage to find some really cool stuff. So I'm going to stop rambling and show you the pieces that I found from Primark. I also have a couple of pieces from Hot Topic as I had a couple of gift cards and I went to Hollister. So there's a couple extra bonus items. First things first. This right here is a Harry Potter Hogwarts sleep shirt. Oh my goodness. It's so, so soft. This is ridiculous. This is like the super fuzzy material. Almost like what I'm wearing basically today because I couldn't be bothered to dress up for you guys because I have a cold and I'm making this video so that was good enough for me today. Still stayed in comfy clothes, but you're getting a video. <laughs> so here is my Harry Potter sweatshirt, sleep shirt, whatever we want to call it. It's gorgeous. I love the Hogwarts castle and it came with pajama bottoms and these have like a moon on them the hogwarts seal stars all kinds of cool stuff mixed in and they're also super fuzzy these were in an extra small and you guys are not going to believe this primark was having a ridiculous like clearance sale these were considered like the christmas pajamas collection these were a dollar one numero uno dollar one dollar <laughs> I need I need a Primark store because I would just be in there all the time. <sighs> I'm just going to have to plan like another trip to Pennsylvania just to go back. Seriously. So cool. So I have these amazing, super soft, super snuggly Harry Potter pajamas that I have already worn like three times. And Nathan's like, you look five. And I was like, I don't care because I'm cozy. <laughs> Along the lines of super fuzzy, we've got another one. Um, This one. I wore yesterday, so it's inside out. Hold on. Here we go. Whoosh. This one has Thumper on it. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Thumper the bunny from Bambi. Super soft, super cozy. I will probably just end up wearing this with like a pair of jeans just because it's adorable. They don't have to specifically be pajama shirts. You could probably do the same with the Hogwarts one, but I think this one you could get away with it more for winter. Isn't he cute? Love it. And going with that are the Thumper pajama bottoms, which are in pink. And then just have him all over. Thumping around with a giant T. Super cute. Great Easter pajamas because it's always still cold. Next we have these pajamas right here. Yeah, I kind of went with a Bambi theme, if you couldn't tell. I had other pieces with me, like I had the Lady and the Tramp. I had uh, a chip from Beauty and the Beast. I had a bunch of them like in my cart. And when I got up to the register, I took a bunch out because I was like, okay, this is crazy. I can't get too much stuff because I've got to fit it all in a suitcase. So I put a bunch back and apparently I just ended up buying like all Thumper. Huh. But this one says, you make my heart thump. Oh, it's just in this gray and white stripe. Cute little bunny. And he's got some flowers around him. And then the bottoms are these little shorts, which are super adorable. They are pink with just thumper laughing, being cute and adorable. And I really, really liked them. And they are basically perfect Valentine's Day pajamas. So there's that. And then because, like I said, Bambi was the theme. I got this one that says, wake me up in the morning. And it has Bambi and Thumper sleeping. 
and it's in pink. I had a thing with pink and a thing with Bambi. Aren't they adorable? Oh, such cute little PJs. And then the bottoms are actually just these uh, plaid striped PJs, which are kind of cool. Flannel. Um, then I got these uh, pants, which were a dollar. I know, right? Um, they have Hedwig on them. I could not find the top to match this, but if you guys remember over Christmas I had this top and I don't really like the shorts too much to them. This says make your own magic and it's blue with like yellow stars all over it and I just thought it would be really cute with these bottoms. So hence we've got little Hedwig, Harry Potter, a Hogwarts letter and then on the back it says Hogwarts. This one also a dollar was Ronald Weasley's Christmas sweater and if you guys have been paying attention my vlogmas this year was Harry Potter and I wish I would have had this but now I have it for next year. Ronald Weasley so cute and it actually says R Weasley on the inside like Molly has like sewn this and then it says property of Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Very awesome. Then I have a like t-shirt dress pajama style shirt thing whatever we want to call it it's a, it's a pajama shirt <laughs> yeah goodness that took a, a long time to get through it says this bunny loves weekends oh yeah i love it super cozy fun loungewear pair it with some knee-high socks and chill out my friends yes winning Then in the kids section, I found this and yes, it is a kids sweatshirt, but I really, really liked it and they didn't have it for adults. So I basically went for the biggest kids section. So I basically went for the biggest kids size. I got the 12 to 13 year olds. I think they have a size bigger, but they didn't have it in this particular one. I just loved this. This is this really fun pastel sweatshirt that says Los Angeles. And then it says Golden State in like white glitter. And it's just so pretty. It just spoke to me. Yeah, I really, really liked it. I thought it was super cute, would look great on Instagram, would look amazing if I end up going back to California this year for 2019, hopefully. Uh, fingers crossed because D23 Expo is this summer and I really, really wanna go. So, loved that. And then I grabbed a couple of purses. Ah! Primark has incredible bags, let me just say. This guy. I think this was $11.99. Is this not amazing? It just has Harry Potter patches all over it. So you've got the platform, the lightning bolt, HP, and then the crest, and then it opens up like a little messenger style bag. It will fit my iPad, which is great because as you guys know, I wanted something to run around with for my iPad. So I love this. I think this is amazing. And the second one I got was this little guy, which is super cute. It is a mini Mickey backpack. <laughs> or mini, mini backpack. Yeah, I loved this. This was probably the most expensive thing there. I think this was like 15 or 16 bucks, but I just loved it as soon as I saw it. I love the quilted detailing of all the little Mickeys. It's got the ears. It's got this little pouch here that has a little gold plated thingamajig that is really hard to do with one hand. But yeah, this opens up and you can pop a few things in the pouch. Ta-da! And then whatever you want in the actual bag. It's super fun! I actually took this around with me for the weekend and just carried like my vlogging camera in here and my wallet and was good to go. I love it. I absolutely love it and I can't wait to take it to the parks. Alrighty, hot topic. Hot Topic basically had this really super confusing buy one, get one free scenario going on. We were in there like 40 minutes and everything I picked up, she's like, no, that's not part of the promotion. And I was like, lady, you're really getting on my nerves. So if you are a Hot Topic employee, please just give people like a piece of paper that says exactly what you can get for the deals and what is off limits. Because I almost just walked out of the store. I was so frustrated. <laughs> 
Ugh. But I did end up getting a couple of cool pieces. So in that madness, I got these sweatpants that say King's Cross. Unfortunately, I didn't get the right size because everything was crazy. And she's like, this one doesn't count. This one does. This one doesn't. You have to get a dress. Uh, with that one, it has to be a skirt or a cardigan. And I'm like, it's on clearance. Doesn't that count? No, it didn't count. So basically it was like buy one full price, get three clearance free. So this ended up being free. Um, so I can't complain too much, but it is the wrong size, which is a bummer. So they're really, really big, but they're super cute. So, I mean, I can tie them super tight and wear them maybe, or I might sell them on Depop. I'm not sure. Yeah, but there's my Hogwarts sweatpants that I really wanted to like. <laughs> I still do. They're just massive. And then I got a one-piece swimsuit. This is a Hogwarts swimsuit. I think it's really cool. So it says like Expecto Patronum, it says Stupefy, Ridiculous, all kinds of Harry Potter spells on here. It's got a wand, it's got a lightning bolt. It's just really cute, very fun. And then the back has like this little crisscross detail. So that'll be nice for when the weather gets a little bit warmer. Uh, this was, I believe, another one of the free items. This was on clearance. This I had never even seen online, funny enough, and I'm on Hot Topics website like all the time. Didn't see this, but I think it's really cool. This is by Her Universe, so good job, Ashley. It says, I speak fluent Disney, and it's embroidered there on the pocket. So cute! Just a fun little cardigan to like throw over a tank top or a dress, and then it's got a crown on the back. Very, very fun. I really liked that. That was, again, I think one of the free items. And then this also got confusing because I thought this was a set and they basically did these as two separate items. So one of these was full price, one of them was not. I think this was buy one, get one half off. I don't remember, like I said, it was crazy. But this is a Riverdale Vixens sports bra workout top. Woo, go Cheryl Blossom, she's my favorite. And then the Riverdale leggings, and you guys may have seen this on my Instagram. I wore these the other day. I've been using the app called 8Fit, and it has really good workouts. This is not sponsored. I just really like the app, and I thought you might too. It helps you plan all of your meals. It gives you workouts that are catered exactly to you and how long you have. So I've been doing like the little 10 minute workouts and I think they're excellent and this set was just really fun to wear so if you want to see this you can see me and Main Street Lucy hanging out on Instagram doing the workout go check it out and what else do we have here this never had seen these online either and I think these yeah these are in the wrong size too I'm so bummed um but they're really really soft I love the kind of like blush pink it's got going on here and it says Disney days are the best days I wish this would have had a shirt that went with it because I think it's super cute and as you can see it's got like shiny gold Disney days are the best days and these are gonna be a little bit big but that's okay they're just for lounging around and I need a Disney trip ASAP then this guy I was really excited about this is super fun this is the Mulan uh warrior palette this i saw all over instagram and was very excited about so when i saw it in store i knew it had to be one of the things that i got it has mushu on the inside uh the mirror says the flower that blooms in adversity is the most rare and beautiful of all and it's got this plastic covering because i have not used it yet so i'll just zoom in and show you some of these colors so pretty the last item from Hot Topic was this right here. Oh my gosh, the camera can't even like pick it up. It's like psychedelic. Basically, yeah, it's this really pretty holographic mermaid shell purse and it has the chain on the inside, a very long chain. Won't fit much, might fit my vlogging camera and maybe like a little bit of change. Maybe my vlogging camera and my phone, but thought this would be really cute for a Disney bound and I like dressing like Ariel, so this is a fun item to have. Then, oh, we do have one more Hot Topic. Dun dun dun, I lied. This was the dress that I ended up getting for, I think, a dollar. It had to be a dress, so I found this one. It says Veronica Lodge, and then it's just this black 
lace detail dress with like little flowers all the way through. Kind of looks like flower pattern to me, but it's basically just lace. But yeah, you channel like Wednesday Adams in this or Veronica. I wish it didn't actually say her name on here because it would have just been more fun to have as like a basic dress, but that's okay. It is still really cool. I'll probably end up wearing this to church and people will be like, what the heck? I don't understand, but that's okay. <laughs> fun for me. Um, yeah, I just thought it was really cool. And for a dollar, you can't go wrong, right? This right here. I'm really excited about. Um, I'm hoping we are gonna end up playing this this weekend. We played this while I was away. My brother got this, brought it over on New Year's, and it's so much fun. It's called Super Fight. So basically, the main person puts down a villain and like two powers that they have, and everybody else has to play a hero and play two cards of their powers and explain how you plan to defeat the villain. It's hilarious, it's really fun, it gets everybody laughing and talking, and yeah. I think this game's incredible. It was the first time I had played it, and obviously we liked it enough that we bought it while we were away. All right, last things. We've got Hollister. This is the Pure Cali mm, perfume. I love, love, love this fragrance. I had it for a while. I ran out, and it's like 35 bucks, so I hadn't bought it again in a while, but I found it while I was away in New York City, and the only thing I bought in New York City was at Hollister, so I got myself this perfume. I got this sweatshirt, oh yeah, it says Hollister, California in this pretty navy blue with the classic red bird, and then the pants to match, because you know I'm all about those matching sets right now. Are you ready for this? Oh, it's so cute. So it's this super duper soft zip up hoodie, oh my gosh, with like this ridiculously soft fuzzy fur on the inside. This was so warm. Uh, we were freezing in New York and Pennsylvania, so I bought this more to stay warm than anything, but I'm so glad I did. It is so snuggly. I didn't want to take it off. I absolutely loved it. And the Hollister items were like 65% off, so I think the sweatshirt ended up being like 15 bucks. This one ended up being around 15 or 20 ridiculously cheap for Hollister so it was a great great find absolutely loved it so yeah that was uh my visit to Primark first time at Primark absolutely want to go back absolutely love the store uh, a few things from Hot Topic Barnes and Noble and Hollister hope you guys enjoyed it let me know your favorite item below and I will see you around like a donut